Okay guys, so this is a quick tutorial about how to auto install a dev file so you don't have to log into or download mobile terminal. Um, this is really good if you want to install multiple things at a time and it's really good if you just want to install one thing because as you know when you put it in the var mobile media when you our var mobile when you put it in that it stays there after you install it. This one gets rid of it. So basically all you're going to do is you're going to SSH into your iPhone and you go var root media and then this file should not be here. So you're going to go right click and add new folder call it Cydia capital C then in that folder you're going to create a folder called auto install and capital A and capital I and that's it. Once you have that one all you do, you drag your dev files to this folder. So let's say So let's say I want to install We'll go V wallpaper. So I'm gonna drag it there. Once it copies, fully make sure it's fully copied. All you're going to do is reboot your phone. Do not respring, reboot. So it means turn it all the way off and turn it back on. If you have SB settings, just go to, just slide your finger, go ahead and go power, and press the reboot. Um, if you don't, just go ahead and hold the power, hold the home and power button until it turns off. Keep holding them. All right. Let go of the home button and hold the power button for a couple seconds and it should reboot. When it's rebooting, it might restart again. That's because it just installed the files and it's redoing it. So I'll show you, I'll, I'll show you here. Um, all you have to do is just go ahead and reboot your phone now. Once the phone is reboot, um, you have to respring the phone. Now I've done with this, this with the nest file. So if you are having problems with the nest file, this works. With the nest file, make sure you reboot twice and then respring. I've been having problems with that. Um, reboot, reboot twice, respring once. Uh, if you guys have any questions about this, that's all you do. So what you're going to do is you're going to create that Cydia file and the folder and then create that auto install folder. Drop your devs in there. Um, when you're done with that, go ahead and reboot your device. Once your device is re fully reboot, respring and you should see those files um, have been installed and they should show up. For certain files you might have to reboot again and then respring a couple times. I don't know why exactly but it's just the way it loads. Um, my NES app is working fully with the autosave feature and the Mega ROMs pack. I will probably do an updated video on that NES um, video just because people have been having some problems with it. If you guys have any questions, please message me. Uh, giveaway at 50 subscribers. And thanks, guys. Have a good day.